Hi all. Today's topic is Millen Thompson method for a problem four. Find the analytical function u plus v is given. So u plus v, what we have to do means we know that f of z is nothing but u plus i v i into f of z. So i u plus i squared v is nothing but i u minus v. So now add both the equation. So we will get. So 1 plus i into f of z equal to u minus v plus i into u plus v. So change the variable this fully with respect to capital F of z and this fully with respect to u plus i into capital V. So now the given costing is nothing but v is given in the costing. So now v is given in the costing x divided by x squared plus v is given means imaginary part is given. Imaginary part given means Milton Thompson according to the imaginary part uh, we have to write the formula. So what is the formula for Milton Thompson method? So that we have to write it. So the formula is So f of z equal to integral over v x okay, with respect to z comma 0 d z plus i into integral over v y this is y this is x but we have to remember it exactly v y v x here v y here vx 5 1 5 2 so vx into z comma 0 at the dz so now vy and vx i have to find so first i will find vx so it is nothing but the differentiation with respect to x i have to do it x means everyone know it is u by v so normal differentiation only x square plus y square the whole square so x square plus y square into with respect to x I am going to differentiate 1 minus x into again when I differentiate 2x. So simplification when I do it is nothing but y square minus x square divided by x square plus y square the whole square. So I am waiting for vx. So vx at z comma 0 when I substitute for uh, x I have to put uh, is uh, z and y is 0. So y 0 means minus 1 by is it square because y zero this is zero so is it square the whole square this one will get cancelled so minus one by is it square same way v y i have to calculate it v y the same thing x square plus y square the whole square so now x square plus y square with respect to y here differentiation zero minus x into again y i have to do it's nothing but two y so i'll be getting minus two x y divided by x square plus y square the whole square so now put at z comma 0 so i'll be getting y equal to 0 so z equal to 0 now substitute in the million thompson method the formula itself so f of z is nothing but integral over v y is 0 this is 0 according to this so 0 plus i into integral over vx, vx I got to be minus 1 by z squared into dz. So minus symbol I will take it to the left, i also outside. So integral over z power minus 2 dz. So integration. Everyone know z power n. Okay, integration when I do it, it's n into z power n sorry differentiation only n into now n plus 1 <coughs> n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 so minus i into integ integration z power minus 2 plus 1 divided by minus 2 plus 1 so what i will be getting minus i into so z power minus 1 divided by minus 1 so minus minus get cancelled so i i will get 
uh, is at inverse. So it can be written as i by is at. I am getting plus constant. Now, what is our question? F capital F of Z equal to I by Z plus constant I am getting. Now, substitute in the given question. So, capital F of Z is nothing but 1 plus I into small f of Z. So, I by Z plus constant C. So, it is nothing but capital F of small f of Z equal to I divided by Z into 1 plus I the whole plus C divided by 1 plus I. C divided by 1 plus I again it is a constant. Basically, we can write it as another constant. So, when I write it. I divided by Z into 1 plus I. 1 plus I I have to remove means what I am going to do take a conjugate. So take a what is a conjugate? 1 plus I the conjugate. So conjugate is 1 minus I. So multiply the conjugate. So I into 1 minus i, I am going to multiply it z into 1 plus i into 1 minus i plus c. So multiply this both 1 plus i into 1 minus i. So when I multiply 1 minus i square, so i square is minus 1 minus 1 plus 1. So it is something but 2. So 2 is it. So what is the answer I am getting? So again I have to multiply this i inside. So when I multiply it, i minus i squared divided by 2z plus c. So i squared is minus 1. So already 1 minus 1, so plus 1. So plus 1 means 1 plus. So f of z will be getting to be 1 plus i divided by 2z plus constant is the f of z. Thank you.